Hi YouTube, Inland Empire Dudes here, and today is the day I'm going to be doing a review on the Black Diamond 10mm runner length uh, 96 inches, uh, 240 centimeters, I think. Um, I don't I don't know, quadruple length sling, uh, I don't I don't hectagonal, you know, length sling. I don't I don't really know what to call this, uh, but it's the black diamond, again, black diamond, um, 10 millimeter. Uh, runner and again, it's 96 inches long. It's 240 centimeters long. I think um, it's the longest one that they have and this is going to be my review of this sling and pretty much what I'm going to say is this sling gets a 10 out of 10. Okay, before um, you may have seen my video on me um, saying how you should have like long cord um, for building a trad anchor, a three point front for building a, a three point anchor um, trad climbing. Um, again, you're going to have three points at least. Um, and and I was saying you really want long long cord and again um, here it is long 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 cord I have lots of lots of cord here but the reason I recommend this over let's say um, a seven millimeter cord um, tying your own cord uh, things like that is this is pre-made pre-sewn you don't have a big knot it's not a bunch of cord it's it's sewn Dyneema Spectro whatever this is um, it's really strong uh, and it's really handy and it beats that cord out uh, like that cord is so old school like this is the future like this is awesome now now let me show you what I meant by having this much cord why this is the perfect length again I said perfect length for almost any anchor you're gonna build trad climbing not a climbing trad climbing so basically you're going to be putting in your three points Into your pieces, you're gonna be drawing a huge. What happened? You're gonna be drawing all three of them together. Okay. Again, even though I'm putting in a knot, I still like that twist. Putting in that twist. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Um. Let's see. Let's, let's get this sewn. Material out the way. Okay, so boom, right there. Now bring it all together. Look how perfect this length is. This length is perfect. Okay, and that's why this sewn material gets a 10 out of 10. Absolute perfection right here. So convenient. This has made my life so much easier after I bought this. Buy two of them, one for each anchor. Um, and again, um, what you can do with this is let's say you have a piece way the way the heck over somewhere. Okay, like, or let's let's okay, like let's say you got a piece way 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 over there. Again, in my original video on how to make it from one double length sling. You can still have that same concept and with so much material, with so much material to work with, you could build an anchor anywhere out of anything. You could just do whatever it is you want. Like, you could do that. Um, you could also, let me get another piece. Let's say uh, we got a piece over here. You could also do, um, let's see. A couple more clove hitches over way over here. If you wanted to build a four piece anchor. And boom, you got yourself God, the anchors are a pain in the butt. Okay, so you could go be over here, and then you could build out of four pieces, you could build an anchor like that. Okay, see so add a piece blue and no catastrophic failure. No shock. Okay, so you could even do that. Let's just 
put this back in just so you can see what the end result was going to be. Um, yeah, look at this. Okay, so you got now you got a four-piece anchor quite easily from this material. This material is super light, not bulky at all. It's great. Uh, this this material, um, this black diamond 10 millimeter runner, 96 inches in length, is perfect. Is ideal. 10 out of 10 from Inland Empire Dudes to you. Black Diamond, good job on this one. Um, let me see, anything else? Um, you could do, let's see, if you really wanted to make a self equalizing anchor setup, just a little tidbit is you do an overhand knot here, back to how to build some anchors. You could do an uh, overhand hand knot here. You could do an uh, overhand knot here. Again, a couple clove hitches. And boom. Okay, this knot, well, let's just just for realism, show what it would actually look like. Okay, and then now, you got yourself a four piece, mind you, four pieces, self equalizing anchor with stoppers, all from this own sling. So again, this sling can do it all. Do it all for your multi-pitch uh, free climbing, is it free climbing, where you don't use any aid? Free climbing adventure. So pick one of these up at your local store today, guys. Inland Empire Dudes out.